time where I started playing for the first time professionally in front of people making a living playing music, uh, which is cool. Footprints in the sand get washed away by the wind and the rain. Start over again. Oh, the rain. Start over again. It was a hip hop show downtown, like something against imperialism. And uh, it was a thing downtown. And none of the acts were hip hop acts that he booked. It was really funny. I was the closest thing to hip hop we had, and I was digging. I've always, you know, been been um, out in nature as a little boy. I, I grew up in a, in a rural setting, and I, I just spend a lot of my time outdoors, you know. And I, uh, my whole life is is outdoor pursuits: whitewater kayaking and cross country skiing. And so I spend a lot of time alone in the outdoors. And so when you, when you're alone in the outdoors, you can do a lot of soul searching, I suppose. You you know, you're always drawing from within, you know. And I and I think. Um, songwriting is a form of, of expressing that uh, time communing with nature. And it's a sweet, sweet life If we can just get past the pain And it's a sweet, sweet life Over and over And it's a sweet, sweet I have other causes now that I'm really, I'm really into. One is, uh, one is to buy up more land to protect in this world, eh? So the TLC in Victoria, yeah, I'm really for that. I'm, I'm really, really for that. So I'm, I'm doing, a, I'm going to do a concert for them, a benefit concert. It'd be interested. In, it's called Earth Dance on the CD. Oh, good. So check out Earth Dance and Sacred. It's like the first line is wild salmon are sacred. Wild salmon are sacred. So are the rivers that carried them home Past the old growth trees To the wild seas Where the eagle glides so gracefully The winds that would tear us apart Tear us apart Raising a child too. Yeah, but I love it, you know, and it's it's really affecting the songwriting because I consider myself first and foremost a songwriter, a singer songwriter, and all this concert and didgeridoo stuff, and it's just a way to express those songs, right? And so I find that these having a family is definitely a positive influence on that songwriting, and it, it changes the way I view the world. You know, it's it's a much softer, more positive light than than maybe it used to be. Won't you be my waterfall? 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 I can feel the energy. If, if people are up dancing, then I know I'm doing something right. You know, if they're not dancing and they're listening and you can hear a pin drop, I know I'm doing something right. If I'm playing and they're talking amongst themselves, well, maybe it's not sounding so good. <laughs> so, so either way, you know, I, I just kind of feel out what's, what's going on and I try to really change the energy. So it's, some songs are just killer, loud and fast and, and then other songs, I, I go for real pretty, quiet songs.
So you, so. you're working with the mood, uh, the mood swings. Yeah, exactly. Like I, I want to hit all the different moods. I want to like happiness, you know, sadness. Straight line